Good morning. Long time no see. Ooh, I still have my glasses on. Ivor Chester here, your balance coach. It's good to speak to you again. I just want to ask you uh, one basic question. What makes your morning good? Is it good tea? I prefer a psalm. I'm not a coffee drinker, really. Is it the person you wake up next to? Is it the sound of your children? Uh, is it the dog? Is it the bills being paid? Ultimately, the answer to the question, what makes your morning good, is going to be you. It's just going to be you. And though this probably isn't life-shattering to most of you, a reality moment is going to be that we have a degree of responsibility of what we are going through. When the crap hits the fan, we have to remember who threw the crap and why are you sitting next to a fan in the first place and why did it have to go through it? Hmm? There's a place for crap and it's not normally in an air motion device. What you're really going to have to start applying is the responsibility to change your perspective, what you're going to do, what it's going to take to uh, get your morning to look like what you want it to look like. Uh, sounds stupid basic. Just a very small example. Uh, I have a contract at 10 o'clock in the morning. Now, I'm not exactly a morning person because I do my best work in the middle of the night. However, <clears throat> I have to be up here at 10 o'clock, which is rather late in the morning. But nevertheless, I have to drive across the Metroplex to get to Arlington from uh, my home in Irving to get here. The um, uh, Sometimes when I, I leave, because I, I wait to the very last minute and I get here and it's... Um, it's rush and it's traffic and it's there's always those jerks that are in front of me. You know, normally it's me. And uh, the reality moment is going to be that this morning I left about 10, 15 minutes early. I ended up getting here about 20 minutes early. Uh, why? Well, because I, I don't know. I don't have an answer. I, you know, a time warp, uh, Stargate.